Ang tunay na lakas hindi nang gagaling sa pera o makinarya kundi sa pagkakaisa ng taong bayan. Nasaksihan ko ito sa mga kababayan natin na araw-araw nagbabanat ng buto para makamtan ang mga pangarap na pinagtrabahuhan nila. Nasasaksihan ko to bawat sakuna na nagbabayanihan para sumaklolo sa ating kapwa. Ngayon, nasasaksihan ko to ngayong kampanya sa mga nag ng mga rallies kahit binapinagbabawalan sa mga gumagastos ng sariling pera, sa mga kumakatok sa mga pintuan para ayain yung ibang sumama. Ang dahilan ng lahat ng ito ay pag-asa. Pag-asa yung tumutulak sa atin na mangarap na sa, sa gulo ng kadiliman ay may kaliwanagan. Pag-asa ang nagtutulak sa atin para makita natin na ngayon lumiliwanag na, ngayon liliwanag pa, at ngayong darating na halalan ang tatanglaw sa buong bayan, ilaw ng tahanan. So, Senator Marcos, you have the floor for your closing remarks. Well, uh, uh, first of all, I thank again our panelists and SMNI for this opportunity to speak on the many issues that uh, have yet to be explored. Uh, and uh, the, 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 the format as well, I think, is quite constructive. So thank you, thank you to SMNI for that. Thank you to, to our panelists here. Uh, we I hope to continue to lay out what programs uh, that form a part of the platform, the planks of my, the platform, for the uh, possibility of for the next administration, for the possibilities for the next administration, and that's why such opportunities, uh, opportunities such as this, are very, very important. And I hope that we have been able to impart some of the ideas that uh, we are. Uh, I am examining and trying to put together to, to, to bring uh, to the next administration should I be uh, elected uh, to the presidency. So we hope that we continue with this, with this discussion. I hope that people come and think about it. And if they have any ideas, uh, please come and tell us uh, because we need to hear from everyone. We need everyone. That is, a, that is, the, that is the cry of the unity team is that we cannot say that anyone uh, is not needed. Everyone is needed in this effort that we are trying to do to get through the pandemic, to recover our economy from the problems that the pandemic has brought, and to position the Philippines to face the new world order and what will happen in the next few years. So thank you all very much, and uh, thank you for the opportunity.